as per one of our subscribers demand we are going to show you how to make iron pyrophosphate nanoparticles today in order to make iron pyrophosphate nanoparticles you will require iron chloride uh, sodium pyrophosphate and ethylene glycol and distilled water so to begin with uh, first we need to make solutions and uh, then uh, we'll show you how to uh, make iron pyrophosphate nanoparticles so what we have here is uh, uh, 30 milliliter uh, solution of 15 ml ethylene glycol and 15 ml distilled water and uh, in this we are going to prepare 0 0.01 molar solution of sodium pyrophosphate so we are going to mix sodium pyrophosphate and it is very easily soluble as you will see that it is it quickly gets solubilized in water and clean glycol mixture so while it is uh, going to uh, get solubilized we will make uh, iron chloride solution so we are measuring 40 milliliter of distilled water and we are going to add already measured iron chloride and this will make 0 0.01 molar solution of iron 3 chloride So our iron 3 chloride solution is ready however this is taking a little bit more time to solubilize so we need a little bit more of stirring in order to completely solubilize sodium pyrophosphate Okay, so now our sodium pyrophosphate is solubilized. So we will take the iron 3 chloride solution in a separating funnel because we have to do a very slow addition. And this addition should be done over a period of one hour. So we have to do it very slowly and under constant stirring. So we turn on the stirring. And now we very slowly open the separating funnel so that slow addition of sodium pyrophosphate takes place. The slower you will add, the smaller nanoparticles you will get. So, uh, while we wait for one hour, so after one hour, as you can see, now the addition is complete and uh, a white precipitate has uh, happened. So, uh, this is a colloidal suspension of iron pyrophosphate, and now we can shut down the stirring. And what you see here is iron pyrophosphate nanoparticles. In order to make even smaller particles, you can prolong the addition of uh, uh, iron into this and, uh, and that will make even a smaller size. But as you can see, it is not settling down, so it is a colloidal solution of iron pyrophosphate. Thank you.